And in the past, touch pads on Windows have really been done very differently because OEMs do them. With Windows 10, we're adding support for power users, users in a touch pad where multiple finger gestures, which all of you power users learn, can make you really efficient. So here I have the same scenario. I'm working on my PowerPoint deck. I've got a bunch of windows, and I've got a touch pad. If I want to make all these windows go away, think of what your hand might do to just say, windows, go away. I'm going to use three fingers and say, go away. Voila, they're gone. Now I went to my desktop. Now I want to get all those windows back. Three fingers, go up. Voila, they're all back. Super fast, super easy. Similarly, if I've got all these windows there and I want to see my task viewer to go to a different desktop, I move my three fingers up and I see my desktops. And then last, think about how you Alt-Tab, except now your hand's on the touchpad. Now we're providing a three-finger way to go left and right and switch between whatever window you want. I can scrub here, I'll choose Word, I pick Word and voila, up it comes, really focusing on smoothing out the power user experience, making all these things work consistently on a wide range of hardware.